You've met National Geographic Zeb Hogan before on WOW Chronicles. He combs the world's waterways looking for the biggest fish out there. His theory is a simple one. The health of the world's waterways can be gauged by the health of its mega fish population. If you still have these giant fish species in the river, it's a good indication that the river is healthy. But most of these kinds of big fish are endangered. Their numbers have dropped dramatically in recent years, and that's bad news for the people who count on the river for their livelihoods and their dinner. He's back in Cambodia, looking for the giant stingray. His first stop is the local fish market. Hey, here's a stingray. Finding them here means there's a decent chance Zeb can find them out on the water. So this is a good sign. We have a, we found a small stingray. The water's low, it's clear. So we need to get out on the river. Their first stop is the Kung Falls, a major fish migratory route. And according to local lore, home to one giant stingray. The largest stingray I've ever heard about, 400 kilos, almost 1,000 pounds, was, was caught right in this location, just below the falls. They don't have any luck at the falls, but over the next few days, working with local fishermen, Zeb begins to get some results. So this is our uh, first giant freshwater stingray of the trip. Uh, this one's about uh, four feet across. 1.2 meters and probably 70 or 80 pounds. Zeb makes a couple of quick captures, but the rays aren't the giants he's heard about. But then... We got a call about a big ray, but I don't buy it, I don't believe it. So many false starts, so many rays lost. When he goes to check out the spot, he finds more than he bargained for. Small mild ray, Zeb, look. And more than he expected. Stingray this size giving birth before our eyes. And just a really oh, cute little baby. The fishermen and Zeb gather around like proud parents. And it's big. This is an impressive ray. This ray is probably we're talking about six, six feet waist. across, more than six feet long, and then the tail seven or eight feet long. So the total length of this fish, certainly over 10 feet, probably. 12 or 13 feet long. The team gets their information and then releases mom and baby. It's a hopeful sign. One new member of a declining class of fish. Not a giant yet, but hopefully this baby will have time to grow. Sponsored by National Geographic Mission Programs taking science and exploration into the new millennium.